Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back to a brand new episode of American Truck Simulator and uh, today it's looking like a pretty simple day I said uh, that since we're sort of done with Idaho, I mean there's Ketchum, Twin Falls and this town left. I was thinking maybe we can uh, go uh, west coast or we will go and or explore all of these places here why not and since we're enjoying so much just doing random deliveries with different trucks experiencing different trucks i thought you know what why not just uh just start exploring uh right now i'm really liking this route here uh from this town or city to burns in oregon that looks pretty cool i'm guessing when we're in this town or city we will see if we can come to lakeview or somewhere over here and then maybe we can make our way back and explore these cities or towns or points of interest so this is a high paying job so for sure i will be taking this it's perfect for us uh it is hull truck chassis so i'm assuming there's going to be like three or four truck chassis stacked so that shouldn't be too bad Let's go ahead and take this job. Uh, guys, please don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment below. Uh, I really hope you're enjoying this uh, series. Uh, I don't make, I haven't made this series like a every other day type of videos really. Oh my god, that's what we're hulling. Damn it. They lied to us. Uh, I do occasionally play this, but uh, not very often. Uh, but since you guys seem to be enjoying it, uh, why not, you know? I will play it as long as you will watch. Let's see how this goes. Very interesting. Very interesting. So since, even though it's a short uh, delivery distance, it is not a very easy delivery by the looks of it. Uh, so once again, do not drive over the estimated route, nor filling stations. Perfect. Uh, obey speed limits, watch out for overtaking traffic and other drivers. Uh, change lane maneuver. So once our guide vehicle comes here behind us to this lane and, and uh, the second vehicle, guide vehicle, in front of us goes to the left, then we are safe to move. All right, got it. Let's look at the view here. Holy cow. Oh look, they have CNB <laughs> news. And why are my heavy uh, oversized load vehicles just parked? They should be in front and behind me. Let's go ahead and turn our truck on. Okay, let's see if we have a map. Yes, we have a map, so we will get rid of this. And I always press the other keys. No. No. Uh, there we go. All right, there's the horn. We are ready to go. Let's see here. Holy cow. Man, I love that engine sound. It's almost like it's a... Uh, it's a... Uh, what is it? Engine braking going on. Wow, open the gate already. Wow, this is seriously wide. Like, seriously. Holy cow. Okay, let's put our left turn signal on. There should be no one here. And we are so clear, we don't need to worry. Wow, how many overloaded vehicles are there? Escort vehicles. Oh, there are coppers there too. You know, I was hoping for one just regular, regular delivery. Uh, we're without the cops, just, you know, escort vehicles, that's it. So. Alrighty. Poppers are moving. Left turn signal, we are going to take a very wide turn here. We might go over this agave here. Nope, we are clear. And let's see if we can make it. Oh no, we already destroyed that sign. Oh no. 
Yep, we are over that fence. Let's turn as much as we can. Right off the bat, we are struggling. Oh, come on. <laughs> oh, what a disaster. No? Wow, you have no power at all, bud. Ooh. Oops. Completely forgot about that. Wow, that engine sound, though, is interesting. Uh, but how the heck am I supposed to make it through this? I think I had to go with that agave and really make a white turn. So much for being an easy job. Okay, where am I gonna hit? Here? Okay. Wow, everyone must be thinking, who the hell did we hire? <laughs> Uh, can I even remain in my lane? Or am I way too wide? I don't know, let's see. Oh yeah, we gotta stay on the left. Or else we're gonna hit here. Wow. This is seriously sketchy. Let's turn our daylight driving lights on. That is the safe thing to do. And uh, we are gonna follow this copper. And see how it goes. Uh, wow, that uh, lumber mill over there. Okay. Uh, we are still going straight and I hate this camera angle. Seems too weird for me. Uh oh. Good thing that car is on the right. Or else we would have been taking him on the tour as well. <laughs> uh, yeah, you know what? This shouldn't be a heavy load at all. It's just like, what, a 40 ton... Uh uh, skeleton of a huge dump truck I mean that's nothing that's your regular uh, probably full load or 75% load so I don't know why we're struggling so much like I am a full throttle down unless I'm dragging like a vehicle with us no we're not but I just don't understand Uh, do they have the highway stopped? Yeah, they have... Yes, they have one or two lanes stopped. But that is so cool. And they're honking at the cop. <laughs> they're honking at the cop. That's so funny. Okay, perfect. Oh, I merged before the front vehicle did. And I don't even know about the back vehicle. Where is the rear vehicle for us? There is no rear vehicle, is there? They lied to us. But it's okay, no one can even like overtake us, so... Alrighty, it is a straight shot back... Or sorry, forward to our destination here. Ooh, look at this river. Looks like a shallow river too. Interesting. Uh, it's, there's greenery here. Oh, there's a broken down vehicle right on the road. Uh, we are already taking an exit. That was quick. Let's put on our turn signal here. Engine brake constant is on. Let's apply our... You know what I wonder? I'm not even gonna stop. 
What I wonder is, what if we end up hitting the cop in front of us? What will happen then? <laughs> will we get like an instant ticket or? Yeah, I have to be on this side, like on that, driving on the line. Hello town. Let me wake you up. Oh, this lane is ending. Uh, I have to wait for the cop to uh, merge first. Man, this truck is very underpowered. Honestly, it's a weak link truck they gave us. Uh, you know what? Now I'm wondering. Uh, for the load menu, you know, at the beginning how we chose the job. Uh, did it tell the weight? of the load maybe it did i'm not sure but maybe in that description in that card maybe they tell us how much this thing weighs okay we're picking up speed here we're going at 30 miles per hour uh it's all in the copper if he wants to slow us down or not uh what is the speed limit here Never mind, we're going uphill, so I really like how the cop car just pushes to the left. <laughs> He's telling the other copper to uh, squeeze to their right. I feel like we've gone from this route before. I don't know why, I have a feeling. Uh, but this is definitely a new route because uh, whenever we explore a town or a city, it uh, makes that bubble expand, which means that, you know, we've been here, we've discovered the place, so. A little pacas or whatever they were. They look somewhere between horse and dog sized. Look at that. That is pretty cool. Wide load coming through. So, uh, how's your day going, guys? Oh, man, August. It came and it went. And, uh, with great sadness, it's September. Oh, man. That sucks. Uh, there goes summer. I I don't want summer to leave. I just, I just miss it so much. I love warm weather. The tired of winter, no. <laughs> Uh, but what a journey it has been for me and for my channel. Uh, you know, like, uh, since May, I've been uploading, uh, videos either daily or I've been uploading maybe two videos during the day. And, uh, I've spent a lot of time on my channel. And, uh, you know, I wish it got further out in terms of viewers and subscribers, but I'm still happy uh, we are 300 strong community for my subscribers and if you aren't a subscriber to my channel uh, i really hope you do subscribe after this i really hope uh did i give you a reason to subscribe too it's not just you know listening to me telling you to subscribe uh i want you to actually well i hope that you actually like the content and subscribe because of that because you want to see more and i really hope that you too and stick to the right now because we have nothing. I really want to flip over an 18 wheeler in this game. I don't know if we can do it, but I was thinking maybe make an episode where I'm just reckless and drive like an idiot and I don't care if I get speeding tickets. I just want to experience how it is. I want to jackknife an 18, 18 wheeler. I doubt this game has the physics. Um, but let's see. Yeah, so interesting a journey here uh, for, well, right now for our 18-wheeler and uh, for myself as well, for my channel as well. Put a lot of heart and soul into it. I really love what I do. Really love this channel. I wish someday it can be really big and I can make this my full-time job. That's that's the dream. <laughs> you know, you would assume you'd have a dream like this when you are a child, but... As an adult, it's just recently, like, I would say maybe 
around two years ago, I think I started thinking, you know what, this this is something I'm I really want to do. And uh, let's see how it goes. You know, I'm I'm gonna get busy, a lot busier in September if everything goes to plan. And uh, I still want to be ooh. Yep, there we go. That was a very cool view though. Let's see what the future holds for us. I really hope uh, your summer went great as well. Uh, it's going great actually summer. It won't end till, I don't know, when it ends officially, like October sometime or something like that. Uh, by that time, it's already going to be like chilly and miserable. So, at least here in Toronto. Man, this truck is seriously struggling. Wow. I mean, we don't even have the bucket on, and that bucket is probably half the weight of this entire thing. So, they should have reviewed <laughs> with the right sized uh, horse. horse would be for this load. Oh, look at that. Look at the scenery to the right. We are up in the mountains. Well, somewhat in the mountains. Not too steep, not too high. But that's the highway we just came from. That's cool. It is nice and foresty as well. We're not in the arid Arizona type of landscape. That's always good. It's refreshing. Uh, let's poke our head outside. Oh yeah, that is awesome. Ooh, they have stopped these 18 wheelers here because they're gonna slow us down that is so cool oh look at the lake no that's a river uh, but that's really cool you know they've put in small details like this 18 wheelers are pulled over there's a copper there's our wide load uh, vehicle it is a nice and winding road I like it oh yeah we are gonna go downhill all of a sudden and I mean elevation wise, hopefully. <laughs> and then uh, speed won't be an issue. I think the cop in front of us uh, will be soiling his pants because we are going to be right up on him. If the elevation drops, that is. Yeah, nice, nice sounding truck though. Okay, we can be on the right because uh, you can see the shoulder. The dirt shoulder is also really wide and the vegetation has been shaved off as well. But we are good. What are these coppers doing? They're, they're stopped in the middle of the road talking to each other. What the hell? Wow, we should take their badge number. <laughs> uh, oh yeah, baby, we are finally hitting 40. I don't think we've hit 40 yet in this load in this truck I actually want to see the cab and behind me please don't hit the vehicle that's gonna be an instant ticket oh we are right up on his tail uh, oh man that was so close holy cow that scared me wow nice bed okay no bed sheet on it I don't know how the heck Oh, you know what? Since this is like a company to company, perhaps no one sleeps in this, but there should be a bed sheet. I don't understand why it's just a simple mattress on. Buddy, you gotta increase your speed. I think 65 is the speed limit as my GPS is showing me. And you are slowing me down. Damn it, we're down to 35 now. Kill the mojo. Mojo Jojo. Uh, we are now down to farmland area. Uh, looks like we're people are growing wheat here, perhaps. I see grass on the left, open field. Holy cow, this copper is pushing it, man. <laughs> it's grazing fields for the horses. Yeah. 
But on the right, like, is this a wheat farm or is this just grazing land for the horses? I, I don't understand. Hello, horsey. Wow. That's so cool. The way the load is attached. Like the trailer behind us has two uh, pivot points. Two separate smaller uh, trailers with it. Very interesting. So we are at Malhur... Malhur? National Forest. Interesting, interesting. Again, inside mountainous roads, we haven't taken any main highways, really. I mean, we did take one highway, but <laughs> what's with these two-lane highways? I don't understand. Like, are there no three-lane highways in America? And we're gonna catch up to this guy, so we're gonna let go. We're gonna apply engine braking. Oh, man. Dude, what are you doing? He has definitely sold his pants at least twice. <laughs> Reduce speed ahead, so let's go ahead and slow down. I'm applying brakes as well. Oh no, we have a, like, a sharp left turn coming up. Are we gonna take this RV? Oh no. Okay, brake too soon. I didn't expect to stop so quickly. Uh, since we're getting an escort, we don't have to worry about making an all-way stop for a second. I thought we were dragging something with us. Oh, I took this too quick. But we are clear. Oh yeah, beautiful. That was beautiful. We are gonna clear, clear of the sign here. I want to take down the rest area sign. People need that. Yep. Wide load coming. Nice view though. Look at how beautiful it is. I'm so happy they've included different shades of green. You know, they have these really nice flowering going on. Uh, what's that? Purple color? Or pink? Man, my, my color palette is just non-existent. <laughs> Even the elementary colors, like the simplest of ones. Uh, but yeah, I'm really liking this. And that copper was telling people to continue on. Did you guys see that on the left? That was, that was stupid. Okay, wow. We just... Comfortably made that turn, but that's because I made a huge wide turn. And I'm so happy I'm doing really well right now. And not the stupidness I did right at the beginning of our journey. <laughs> uh, that was funny. Okay, oh wow. This Prius driver parked it right on the pole. Hopefully they don't have a passenger. Whoa, 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 whoa. What the heck happened? I heard a beep. Did I get like a, a fine? I don't think I got a fine. Or else it doesn't matter what view you're in. You're gonna, you're gonna know it. So I don't know why, what happened there. He slowed down a lot too. I don't know why. Alright, so we had this small town that was inside a national forest, which I don't understand. But now we are... I, I really like this view, guys. Seriously. See, he's slowing down again. What, what the hell is he doing? I don't understand. What's your problem, dude? Oh, it's gonna take another year to speed up again. What is going on? Are we going uphill? Probably. Uh oh. Car, 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 car. Yeah, I, I really like the lush greenness. 
So we have trees, we have evergreens. Well, these are all fir trees, aren't they? Ooh, look at that bus. Look at that color. All right, wow, lots of winding roads. Holy cow, that's a lot of winding roads. Look at that, look at the map. Going straight, then we're gonna go back, then we're gonna go straight again. And with this struggling truck, it's gonna take us a year to get to our destination. Oh, let's hope we make it. <laughs> uh, guys, I'm floored. Okay, like the pedal is to the floor right now. I am not uh, coasting. It's the truck doing it itself. So, there we go. I need some downhill motion here. Life would have been a lot better if uh, the copper in front of us wasn't there, honestly. Just block the intersections for me and that's all I want. We're going uphill again and we're making another U-turn type turn here. Uh, 60 miles per hour is the limit for trucks. Uh, this episode, we haven't even been doing half of that, honestly. Uh, but it's fine. Uh, this is made out of, I don't know, gold or something. Solid gold. This gold is very heavy. And uh, the skeleton is probably that heavy. Why is the copper waiting on the other side? I don't understand. Oh, you know what? He's blocking traffic from this turn here, probably. That might be it. Yep, we are going uphill again. Uh, let's change the view up, huh? This is extremely loud. My ears are going to bleed, so I am going to change. We have a lot of room to play with right now, so that's why I'm just changing views and enjoying. Nice, okay. We're gonna struggle now because it's uh, uphill now. Okay, woof. Wow. Let me show you guys where we came from. We came from. Where did we come from? Where is our road? I don't see it. Oh, it's all the way down there. Holy cow, dude. We gain elevation. Okay, that is cool, man. Yeah, so, you know, on the map, it looks like a simple job, but uh, uh, we had to go through mountainous roads, and uh, that's why we're just struggling so much in this delivery. That's why it was an expensive delivery, too. Not only because of the white load, but because uh, going uphill, going downhill, making so many sharp turns, putting up a traffic. But I have to say, uh, elevation change has been our biggest enemy so far. Uh oh. Yeah, if I can. Oh my god, stop it. Dude, what the hell are you doing? What the hell are you doing, you idiot? Ah. Uh. See, when I can't stop in time, I am going to go into the other lane because I don't want to take out this guy. 
Uh, but instead, this guy's like, oh, you're going to try to overtake me? Oh, let's see about that. Ah. This is why we're getting paid the big bucks. <laughs> oh, look, he's slowing down again. Come on, come on. We're finally hitting 50, guy. 50, 50. Ugh. Stop it. Stop doing this to me. 60 miles per hour is the speed limit for us. Our um, GPS is showing 65, which is for the cars. For trucks, it's going to be 60, probably. Let's try to keep it a bud. Swing down again. Why? Why? Why are you doing this to me? They're purposely making sure Oregon State Police, you guys don't know how to drive. Alright. It's unfortunate, but they're purposely making sure that on the downs, on the parts that we can actually go at the speed limit, that they purposely slow us down so our delivery time, you know, is uh, what they want. That it takes a long time for us to get there. And that is not cool. Wherever we can make up for the lost time from all of that slow speeds, like I want to make up for it, you know, by at least going at the speed limit, but they're not letting me. Look at that, 60 is our speed limit. But now we're going uphill, so it doesn't even matter. Downshift, come on, downshift more. Oh, come on, downshift, dude. That's the issue when uh, you're driving automatic. With manual, I wouldn't, I wouldn't be able to keep up. I just don't have the experience anyway, driving manual. So we're just gonna keep up with it, put up with it. And we have blocked the way of another entryway here. Okay, sharp right turn coming up. We will engage our engine brakes and regular brakes as well. Okay, do they have this lane blocked? They don't have this lane blocked. Why? Oh, we are so good on this one. Yep. And this bridge is going to be toyed. Let's see how this goes. Oh no, that idiot just parked his car over there. Okay. Oh, we're good. We're good. Oh, comfortably good. Even if he was up there, he would have been good. Okay. I think our destination is close by now. 45 is the limit. So at the bottom, you see how it says 65? I guess it's not the speed limit. I guess that's just. I don't know what the heck that is. We cannot be on Route 65, can we? Like, we just took a right turn to another road. You know, that Route 65 should have ended. We have to take another left turn soon, so... Oopsies. Uh, we have to take another left turn soon, so we will see. See, that's Junction 78. Oh. Oh, now it's 40. No, that is the speed limit, guys. Because it's uh, highway or road 78 to the left. Oh yeah, I forgot. We don't have to stop for red lights. When we turn here, it should become route 78. Wow, the truck is so impatient. <laughs> Good thing it's a wide two-lane road here. Uh, No, guys. That is the speed limit. Because it's saying 40 now. Yeah, it wouldn't make sense, I guess. But that's pretty cool. Uh, it tells us the speed limit, but it's uh, really slow at it, though. Whew. What a journey, guys. What a journey. That was definitely not an easy journey we had to make. Why do you break check me? And why is no one uh, blocking the road here? Alrighty, copper. Bye-bye. 
Oh, imagine we had to reverse park this. <laughs> that would be funny. Uh, more news crews here. They've never seen a wide load being delivered. Look at this. They're building homes. And we're bringing this mining dump truck chassis. Sorry, not skeleton chassis. This does not make any sense at all. This is so stupid. But you know what? Maybe someone ha is, uh, has custom ordered the house. And they said, in my living room, I want this, you know, $750,000 chassis of a dump truck that my grandpappy used to drive. And they're like, alrighty, just pay us another million bucks and we'll do it. And there you go. It doesn't have to make sense, we're just making money. So we're not going to question it. Excellent. Uh, rough start. I don't know how. Uh, we still got an excellent rating. But uh, ooh, we've become an enthusiast. <laughs> okay, great. Uh, 319 kilometers. Again, a little bit of experience. Proficiency bonus. Okay, sure. Uh, high value cargo. We haven't leveled up in that. So we got nothing. Uh, trailer maneuvering bonus. We just got experience and no money for those. Continue, let's level up our fuel. You know what, guys, I was thinking, since I'm going to be just using all of these uh, contracted jobs, like, I don't think I'll ever get enough money to buy my own truck. This fuel economy is sort of useless, isn't it? Just in time delivery. Important deliveries unlock 3% higher reward for finishing an important delivery. 20% bonus for finishing an important delivery. This, guys, is going to make it become uh, race mode, and I don't want that. <laughs> because, oh man, I am going to be breaking the law left and right. Fragile cargo. Fragile goods unlocked. Higher you know what? Let's go. Oh, high value cargo. 5% higher reward. I think this is going to be better. Yeah. Let's go with that. High value cargo. Uh, we don't need long distance right now. We just want more money and XP, right? 5% higher value delivery, 18% experience bonus. Oh, perfect. We should have done this a long time ago. Guys, I really, really hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, please don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment. And uh, please suggest what else you would like to see in the series. Uh, please let me know what other game you would like to watch me play and like to watch yourself. And uh, I will see you in the next episode. Until then, guys, enjoy.